Right now at 530, a man and woman are in jail after a boy with autism overdosed on meth. 31-year-old Stephanie Williams and 36-year-old John Green are both charged with child neglect and possession of meth with intent to sell. Police tell us the boy did survive that overdose. News for Jack's reporter Coralie Peel is joining us live from the San Pablo neighborhood with what neighbors are talking about and saying. Coralie? The boy overdosed in a mobile home inside this mobile home park here off Beach Boulevard. And neighbors tell me that the home that he lived in is known for drugs. And according to the police report, Stephanie Williams told investigators that John Green was selling meth and fentanyl to people living inside this mobile home park. On April 1st, Police say Stephanie Williams said the boy started to look sleepy and unresponsive. And according to police, the boy is nonverbal and diagnosed with autism. Williams then put the boy in a cold shower, but couldn't feel his pulse. According to the report, the boy then started turning blue. First responders arrived and then they took the boy to the hospital where investigators say they learned he overdosed on meth. And the report shows the boy was given Narcan, which he did respond to. And the next day, police searched the home where they found meth and drug paraphernalia. They say John Green tested positive for meth and denied that it was his narcotics that the boy ingested. Police did not say how old the boy is, but in the police report, officers did say that the drug paraphernalia found inside the home was easy for a toddler to ingest. Both Stephanie Williams and John Green are both being held in Duval County Jail. Reporting live from San Pablo, Corley Peel Channel 4, The Local Station.